Hello angels, welcome back to Scripting with Charles. Today's tutorial, we're going to be discussing the difference between count plus plus, like a variable plus plus, like incremental, or plus plus count, essentially. So uh, both of them do the same thing, just increase the count, but we want to learn what's the difference. So right here, I have a very, very simple application um, in vanilla JavaScript. And so if I increase it, it increases. How, if I also do this, okay, sorry. If I also do this and save and refresh, it still increases. So we want to find out what's the difference. Essentially, the difference is what this returns. That's the difference. This returns a number. Same thing with this. It they both return a number. So now we want to find out what it returns. So let's just put const x is equals to this. And let's find out what this returns. So say x. So refresh. And then see. So if it's if the incremental sign is before. If it's before, it returns it returns what was increased. So let's say it is zero, then it will be zero plus one, and it will return one. If it was two, it will be two plus one, and it will return, you know, three. So essentially, it's going to return the increase. This is different from if we do. Let's change this to plus plus here and refresh. So now you see what's going to be returned. It's zero, I increase it, it shows one, but what's it returning? It's returning zero. It's returning zero. So it's returning the initial value. It's returning the initial value. If I, no, not the initial value, the value at that moment. Yeah, or I call it the present value. So you can see it is one. So now it's two. If I hit increase, it changes to three. However, it's returning two. So that's the difference. That's the main difference between um, putting the incremental before or putting the incremental after. You may ask yourself, okay, so why is this important? Okay, let's put this into React, for example. So I've created a very simple React application with a Vite. So I'm just going to remove all this. And yeah, so let's just remove all this. And let me bring it in. So we'll post this. So now we see count is zero. It increases. So let's modify the code. Now you can see here it's saying set count is count is usually this will be previous. If you, yeah, and then this would be previous plus one. Now you could decide to do previous plus plus, but the problem now is that nothing will change. So if you refresh and you click, you can see nothing is changing. Why is nothing changing? Because of how React works. So it's comparing, so it's comparing the value it's seen that React would only change when the value of the state is different. So presently, it's zero. But with what we've just learned, we know that if we do plus plus, it's going to return the present value, which is zero. So React is looking and it's saying, okay, it was zero before, now it's zero again. I don't need to change anything. Yeah. But if we do plus plus previous, it would increase it and return the increase. So if we go back and we do this, you can see it increases. So that's like, so whatever the situation is, depending on what you want to do, now you know the difference between putting the incremental before or the incremental after. So I hope I was able to explain that properly. If you have any other question, please do let me know. And if you if you've not subscribed, please do subscribe. Also, help me to like the video, and I'll see you in the next one.